Are you someone who enjoys working with power tools? Hi everyone, this is Michelle. I do. I find that they enable me to do more creatively. So having a power tool or two can actually be a really good investment in your creative future. And today I just want to touch on a really simple, inexpensive power tool that's easy to operate that you can really get a lot of mileage out of creatively. And I'm talking about a drill. Not only does it enable you to drill through pretty much any material that you run into, whether it's plastic, metal, wood, glass, glass, concrete, there is a bit for all of it. So if you have the right bit, you should be able to drill through just about anything. And I wanna focus on a couple of special bits because I have a lot of people always wondering how to drill through rocks for doing jewelry pieces. Well, two of the bits that I've had success with are the glass and ceramic tile bits. You can get different sizes in those or the diamond tip bits. Either of these uh, work well depending on what type of rocks you're working with. Um, either bit though, you need a water bath. So just get a container of water. I put a little wood in the bottom so that I don't drill through my container and then uh, make sure your rock is covered with water and then slowly work your bit through the rock and you should be able to uh, drill holes no problem and then you can create some beautiful jewelry pieces out of it. You can also get different attachments for your um, drill that aren't for drilling but for sanding or or polishing or stripping all kinds of different pads you can get wire wheels if you need to do something more aggressive this one is awesome because uh, it kind of turns your drill into an orbital sander uh, get a di sanding disc that goes in here and then if you need to do a little power sanding works beautifully you can also get different covers for it for more finishing work waxing and polishing uh, you can also create some of your own uh, bits uh, i like to put um, a wooden dowel in here and this is a really great trick to create some of your own jump rings and do some uh, neat uh, wire work and wire twisting i just wrap the wire around there and then you can slowly run your drill and then that coils that up beautifully. You can uh, cut them down. And again, you've got all of your own jump rings to work with, but lots of possibilities. Next time you're at the home improvement store, check out the drill bit aisle, see all the things you can do with your drill. And you just may be taking your creativity up another level.